Why howdy everybody and welcome to the Jim Carrey channel. Uh, I, gotta, I have to check with you and see if you've heard about this nonsense. These two idiots, a guy and a girl, uh, threw like, I think it was four or five footballs over a prison fence into the courtyard of the prison filled with some drugs and some other things we'll get into in a minute. But it's as though the guards are going to say, gee, they've been playing a lot of football. I guess that's why there's six or eight footballs laying around with tape all over them. Uh, well, yeah, that kid, that's nothing. So anyway, they cut them open, and there's a little bit of pot, a little under an ounce, which isn't that much. And uh, I forget what, what the one other little item. And the thing that kills me is 12 cell phones and chargers. The world has gone mad. If you're in prison, you're, what are you going to be doing? Going, oh man, if I don't get my cell phone, dude, dude, dude I'm sick, I'm sick. I got, I, I got to have my cell phone, dude. Dude, I'm going to, I'm going to puke. I'm going to puke and check my cell phone quick. What? Who are you going to call from jail? They monitor all that stuff. It's just absurd, you know. It's like, can you hear me now? Can you hear me now? And um, anyway, the guards found all this stuff, and these guys got busted, which I think is hysterical. And uh, so they'll get to go in the same prison. Maybe somebody could throw them over a softball with some thread in it, so they could crochet or something. I don't know. Um, oh, there was one other thing on my mind too. LAPD is has gone mad. Yeah, you've probably seen on the news they're doing it. They've got this um, museum in Vegas of hideous things like weapons that have been used to kill people. Um, pictures of Marilyn Monroe dead, the real picture. Uh, things that you can pick up and hold them. It's getting, the cops are getting sicker than we are. It's really scary. The cop, it's like, how can you put anything so gru gruesome in a museum and go, oh, let me hold this machete. This just whacked off six or eight heads. That's really nice. I like this. Still got blood on it. Isn't that cool? Uh, a picture of Marilyn Monroe, which I, I did see uh, on the news. It's so sad. She's face down, but she's like, she's dead! <laughs> and they're, they're calling this a museum. Everybody's protesting it, and some of, some of the people are getting their things uh, the families are getting their things removed, the people that... Uh, they had the, the, what was it, the uh, shirt? The shirt and jacket that Bobby Kennedy was wearing when he got shot all to pieces and is covered with blood and people could come in and handle this. I think we all need a mental tune-up or, or something or maybe we need to uh, change police forces. Damn, the phone is ringing and it's not important, so I better answer it. Anyway, um, check out my channel, this Jim Jim Carrey channel. I just wanted to do a quick quick vlog because I got uh, into some other things and I just got out of jail myself. <laughs> so, no, I'm just kidding. I was tied up and thank God she untied me. And uh, so I had I haven't been on online for I don't know three, four, five, eight, ten somewhere three or four or five days and I just wanted to check back in and say howdy I'll be coming out with a coming up with a bunch more stuff some music and uh, some comedy sketches so uh, check in and please do um, leave a comment uh, subscribe rate uh, be a friend I, I I'm looking for people to work with for particularly comedy sketches anyway peace be with you remember what what's my favorite line uh, what is, oh God, man, I've got a brain tumor. I just, you ever get that brain fart where you're just completely blank and, and you feel like you're actually dumber than Tom Hanks when he played the, well, uh, life is better than a box of chocolates or whatever the hell it was. Anyway, I don't remember what I was going to say, but I'll talk to you all later and peace be with you.